Good morning everyone and welcome back to a brand new vlog. I hope you are all well. We're just getting ready, well Jamie is ready, I think he's downstairs watching a Mini Cooper YouTube video. I can't remember if I told you guys, but obviously you know that I've ordered a Mini Cooper, but Jamie has ordered one as well. He loved it so much that he has ordered a red one, so we're gonna have matching Mini Coopers on the driveway, which is really sweet. But um, So I think he's just watching a YouTube video on it downstairs, but um, I have just finished getting ready for the day. I'm wearing my Ula Johnson dress today with my biker boots, and I have got on my necklace of the day, if it's going to focus, there we go, is my um, Monica Vinader, it's the gem chain, and then I've got the pendant on there, and the pearl there as well, so I'm loving that little combination actually, and just peeking through the dress I think looks really sweet. I am hoping to get an Instagram picture today for Monica Vinader, so I'm hoping that this dress will be nice and do the jewellery justice. So plan of today, I'm not really sure to be honest, it is Sunday today so no work, although I have done about two hours of paperwork this morning, running your own business, great fun, but uh, never mind, that is done now and so we have got the rest of the day, I think we're going to go to the pub in town and get some of the bar snacks, that we got. we've got them in a couple of vlogs, so I think we're going to do that and obviously get this picture done for Monica Vinader, but other than that, I'm not really sure, so I will bring you along with me, whatever we get up to. Um, tomorrow is Monday, I have got quite a few bits of work to do tomorrow, but I want to try and get some time that I can start just putting some outfits together for holiday as well, so I will include that in this vlog too. Um, which is very exciting because it is two weeks or less than two weeks um, until we go now, which is so exciting. I cannot wait. I had a bikini try on this morning and you know when you just go, oh, I don't like any of them, I don't want any of them, and I just have a moment. There are a few that I really, really love, but um, I've got three that are my favourites, that I'm like, yep, they're definitely coming, they look lovely, they're really flattering, um, but I feel like I want, a, I want another one. It's silly, I've got so many bikinis, I do not need another one, but I am trying to persuade Jamie that, you know, he should buy his wife a new bikini because he's going to be looking at her while she's on holiday. You know, I think that's a great idea. Do you not agree? I just think, you know, he should chip in. Anyway, so, <laughs> oh, let me go know what you think in the comments. But yeah, I, I'm feeling that we can work on him and maybe persuade him that, you know, a little treat for his wife might be something nice. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go and hurry him up. I'm going to go and hurry him up. There we go, if I can speak. And we will get going with our day. I'm still loving my tablescape there. There's Betty. Sorry, ignore the mess there with the throws. It's just when Betty's on there, she likes to lick her feet on the sofa, doesn't she? And she gets it all dirty. So we put all the throws on. It looks a bit of a mess, but uh, it does protect the sofa. There you go. You're talking about licking your feet. Hoi! Stop it, you're going to make them bald. You are. You are. Oh, she's got a little ear infection at the moment, bless her. So she's shaking her head out a lot and she's extra cuddly because she's feeling a little bit sorry for herself, aren't you? Yes, you are. But yeah, loving my tablescape still. Yeah, how amazing would this look at a wedding? I feel like maybe I should change careers and do wedding tablescapes instead. What do you reckon? <laughs> Lovely, I love it, so happy. Hello guys, we have just got to our favourite pub in town. We got some pictures for Instagram for the jewellery piece. So I'll pop the pictures up on screen now if you want to have a little look. And of course I'll pop my Instagram details up on screen. So if you're not following me, do make sure you are. Um, but yes, Jamie was chief photographer, weren't you? As usual. Thrilled about it. <laughs> Bless him, he does so much for me, he really does. But we're just sitting outside in the pub garden and they've popped up a really gorgeous tent, which I think they used during lockdown. We never came here during lockdown, did we? Um, but so yeah, I think they used it during lockdown and they popped it back up to have outside throughout the autumn and the winter and it is just so beautiful in here. I'm gonna spin you around and just quickly show you. Jamie's drinking his coffee there. I was using his face to get the camera to uh, focus. Yeah, usual coffee. And so this is the tent 
no, not tent. I keep making that mistake. We're going to call it a teepee because it kind of feels like a teepee in here, but it's beautiful, beautiful. The lights are stunning, so, so pretty. I kind of want to tell them to hang some flowers from them as well because I think that would look even more beautiful, but it's really sweet in here, really lovely. And we have the usual. We're just waiting for some chips. We're also going through Jamie's uh, Amex app to see if there's any deals that we can get on bikinis. <laughs> He's such a good husband. Such a good husband. So guys, we've just come to our local garden centre to have a little look round. And they have got some really gorgeous autumnal bits. I mean, look at this. How nice would this be? in our porchway or there's even some better ones over here some really nice bright oranges and things and there's some other colors down here i could just think they're really beautiful autumnal colors it would look great in the porch so maybe i'll have a think about coming back and kind of doing some sort of display with them and some pumpkins and all sorts of stuff in the porch that would be quite fun so maybe i'll have a think about that but uh, just thought I would kind of show you what we look at and what we get up to here. This peachy orange is gorgeous. Really beautiful. Guys, they've got their Christmas stuff out. Their Christmas stuff. <gasps> it's magical. Okay, I am loving this wreath. I feel like that looked nice on my dressing room door. Good afternoon everyone and welcome back. So it is now the next day. We had a really chilled out rest of the day from when I last spoke to you yesterday. It was just nice and relaxed. We just had some nice dinner. We made um, healthy fish, chips and mushy peas which was very very nice and just had a nice relaxed evening. I've done a little bit of work this morning. Well I've actually done quite a lot of work this morning. It is now 3.05 and I've just got an hour or so before I need to log on and teach a Zoom class but I just wanted to quickly have a little look at my wardrobe, pull out some bits and pieces for holiday that I think I might take, kind of whittle it down a little bit ahead of packing probably at the weekend or maybe next, um, next week. So I just thought that I would show you guys what I'm thinking. Now what I did do yesterday is I did um, try on some swimwear. I think I told you um, earlier on in the vlog that I tried on all of my bikinis and my swim costumes and just decided what ones I definitely wanted to take and what ones I didn't. There were three definites which I have packed away into my packing cube. I love packing cubes, by the way. If you don't use packing cubes when you go away, you're missing out on a trick. I mean, how handy is that? Just knowing that all my swimwear cover-ups are in this little cube. I love it. I think they're blinking brilliant and they are so inexpensive on Amazon. So, um, yeah, I might do like a come pack with me video if you think that would be fun, then do let me know. But uh, I th I'm thinking that that might be quite a nice video. But um, yeah, so I've packed my swimwear away. I was trying to persuade yesterday Jamie to buy me a new bikini. Um, he has said he put some money towards one for me because he's such a good husband. So I have ordered one. Hopefully um, that will arrive later on in the week and we will see what that looks like. I will show you it as and when. Hopefully it will be added into my taking away with me. So I've done that because that's got all stuff in it that doesn't need to necessarily be um, ironed or anything like that. It's kind of can just be put on straight from the cube. So that doesn't you know, matter if it's packed early. So, let's have a little look to what I've got in my wardrobe. Now, the first thing is my newest dress, which is this beautiful, beautiful Zimmerman number. Um, it has got the belt there as well, which goes around it. It is truly a stunning, stunning piece, this. Um, it is the size up. I think a couple of vlogs ago, I tried this on with you and I had the zero zero. And I think I said to you, I was gonna send it back and get the zero um, because it was a little bit longer. And so that's what I've done. And the rest of the sizing is exactly the same, but it just has a bit more length to it. So it is ideal now, it is beautiful. But I mean, just look at the embroidery detail there. It's just so, 
so so beautiful and I love the buttons as well let me move that out of the way and I can show you those a little bit more the little embroidery flowers on the buttons so gorgeous so so perfect so that is definitely going to be one of my evening outfits now bag wise I think um, because of the belt I think that my um, Saint Laurent pouch will go beautifully with that so I think it will be this bag I'm just going to pop my accessories as well around shoes wise I'm going for my rock stud Valentinos I think that will be a fabulous combo so that is evening outfit number one I'm just going to hang it up on there now what else have I got so I've got five evenings that I definitely want to pack for ah this I love so this is again a Zimmerman number there may be a running theme here um really gorgeous gorgeous jumpsuit it's kind of a vintage floral pattern really really beautiful there you go it's a bit better with the lighting there Betty snowing behind me as always and again it comes with a little belt there as well where's the other side of it there it is so a little belt that will cinch it in and a nice wide and comfortable leg so definitely taking this I reckon actually Valentino's and probably Saint Laurent bag will do the trick for that one I have of course got the Amazon bag but I'm thinking the Saint Laurent will go better I think that's a better combo yeah for sure for sure okay so that's good because that's the same shoes and um, bag so that's handy okay so that's outfit number two let's see what else have we got oh, I love this dress okay yeah so you've seen me wear this multiple times actually this would be quite a nice day dress if we end up going into town or something and having a little look around the town that will be an ideal sort of day dress so I'm thinking that I will want to take some flats with me for that so I have got these which are very beautiful and will look very very nice with that so that is a possibility now I also have hold on um, aha. these babies as well so these were the dupe versions of the Miu Miu ones that I saw and then I actually saw these and got these instead because they were a lot cheaper so these are from June and I think they were £60 and the Miu Miu ones well that's just over there a lot more so but they look pretty much the same so actually I think that they would look quite nice with the white dress and they are so comfortable so I think that might be option number two so I'm going to definitely take those with me and bag for that I reckon we could probably then make use of my lovely Amazon number because I think yeah I mean look that's just so classic and so gorgeous so let's pop that down there as well so I think that's going to be a day outfit so I've got two evenings one day I think actually we probably won't all go out more than once I think we may do I might, might take two day outfits just in case but I think most of the time is going to be spent in the hotel and chilling around the pool which sounds ideal to me ah yes I've got my little Vita Grace set this needs an iron or a steam but my little um, two-piece Vita Grey set so that could go for either day or night actually so if we end up doing a, another day trip then that would be ideal but that could also work as a night one I think for the night I could wear the um, rock studs and then this little bag um, or I could go for some flats for during the day so I think these would look gorgeous with that though during the day so I'm gonna have to take those as well so I'm gonna pop those up there okay I'm supposed to be packing light because we have one case between us so we'll see how that goes oh dear oh dear oh this is a beautiful little skirt so this is a really lovely wraparound skirt it's very very similar 
fabric, how similar is that, to my Zimmerman one. This is the one that my best friend made me. It's so gorgeous. She made it for um, my birthday. I love it so, so much. So I'm definitely going to take that. Um, I actually think that looked really nice just with a little bikini top how cute is that the bikini that i've ordered is like olive green and i think that's going to look so nice so definitely taking that and that doesn't take up any space we're fine we're fine okay oh yes yes and yes definitely definitely taking this beauty um i wore this to a wedding not too long ago but it's just so fun look at the big puffy sleeves I love it. So this will be an evening number. Now, I don't think that I will wear these shoes with it. So I am thinking what I wore to the wedding was my black Valentinos because there are bits of black actually in the patterns. So, oh no, that means I'm going to have to take another pair of shoes. Jamie's going to be thrilled. So that and that and my bag i would probably want to go with charlotte okay so how many bags is that that's three bags now okay well let's just just put them down and then we'll work it out we'll work it out so that's three evening um i want to take that oh this is actually this needs to go in my cover-ups thing because this is a very very cute little lace play suit this is just from h and um it really was very inexpensive but it's perfect just to pop on over your um bikini to go down to breakfast or something like that so it's ideal for that so i'm actually gonna in a moment fold that up and pop that into my packing cube because that needs to be worn love this skirt so much it's so beautiful but i don't think that that will be ibiza wear what else have we got oh i've got my new dress of course i always forget or oh, i always forget i keep forgetting about this one because it's folded this is my um grecian wraparound dress if you remember it's the dress that i tried on at the same time as i bought this zimmerman number so this is definitely going so this is four now evening outfits and this will go with either uh, this will go with my tan valentinos and my amazon bag beautifully so i will take that so that's four evening outfits i just need one more evening outfit i mean i don't know whether to then go all out for my last evening outfit <sighs> what do you think what do you think now i love this one it's a lovely little one-shouldered number it's all sequin it's gorgeous this is the dress that my um again my best friend made me that made me the skirt it's so 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 stunning and it can be different colors kind of thing whichever way you press down the um sequins so pretty so so pretty so that would be like a really special night out. Now we are planning on going to Bambuda, I think it's called, which is quite a nice fancy place to eat. So I wonder whether I would wear this for that. So yeah, that can be then outfit number five. So we have got five evening outfits there. I've got one, two, three day outfits well no two day outfits really because this is going to be i think more around the pool although it will look fabulous actually with a linen shirt tucked in so we'll just take that as well because that could be another day outfit so we've got one two three pairs of shoes and three bags and of course i will be taking my dior tote bag um for like putting stuff in for the beach and stuff but i actually think that i will take that on the plane as my carry-on so that won't necessarily have to be packed so actually i think that's not too bad i'm hoping that jamie won't complain too much i reckon that i can put some things in my carry-on like i will probably pop my chanel in my carry-on because i won't want to risk her going and getting squashed in the case but yeah I think I did quite well. I'm not going to fold it or steam any of it now because I feel like it's a little bit too early for that. But I'm just going to section it off in the wardrobe for holiday bits. 
and I feel that that's quite a nice job done actually yeah very good very good right then guys that is all put away back in the wardrobe ready to be steamed and then packed so I will steam it all before I pack it I will take my steamer with me because it's a nice portable one um, to just steam out any creases that it may get in the suitcase but hopefully it won't be too much if I steam it before so yeah I'm gonna finish off the video here because I'm about to log on and teach one more class before I finish for the evening so I will say my goodbyes. I hope that you enjoyed today's video. As always, give it a thumbs up. Thank you very, very much for watching as always guys and I will see you all in the next video. Have a lovely, lovely week. Bye.